Hello everybody and welcome to the February edition of the Rector's Blog. I hope you're all doing well and this month we'll be talking about sports at the English School. We have a thriving sports department at TES where students, both boys and girls, across a variety of age groups and abilities, stay after school for training with highly qualified and experienced coaches, participate in matches with other schools in Bogota and beyond. We work closely with the organisations of UNCOLI, the Union of International Schools in Colombia, and ACBI, the Andean Association of International Baccalaureate Schools. We offer a wide variety of sports, including football, basketball, athletics, volleyball, table tennis, gymnastics and chess. And this really represents the wide diversity of talents and abilities our students have. And for us as a school, being mindful of the unique strengths and interests of each student. Our sports teams are linked profoundly to our strategic pillars of a comprehensive culture of excellence through academic excellence and promoting leadership in our students. Also, in terms of the English way, we promote a sense of identity and community, reflected in the fact that this year we have over 400 students representing our teams wearing our official TES sports uniform, which helps create a sense of togetherness and unity. The English way is also demonstrated through prioritising the physical and psychological well-being of our students, through regular exercise and the opportunity to collaborate, learn new skills and improve developing a balance between academic studies and focusing on personal passion and hobbies. I would like to highlight some of the fantastic achievements from our sport team so far this academic year. From a variety of age groups across the school, including in the Copper Acby, held in December of last year and beyond. In volleyball, we have played five semi-finals out of the six Uncolly and Acby tournaments we have participated in, with an excellent result of two first place, two runners up and one third place position. In football, we've been the champions in the Elizabeth Basson Cup and runners-up in the Gymnasial Campestre Cup. In athletics, we are the Uncoli champions in girls sprinting and chess, we are the Uncoli champions. Coming up in the future, we are very excited about some of the national and international events we will be participating in. In February, we'll be sending the sports delegation to Cali and in March, we'll be sending the sports teams to Barranquilla. We will also host the Copper Acby National Children event which we'll be hosting from the 28th to the 30th of April here at TES. Finally we'll also be competing at the international level with volleyball in the world's largest school volleyball tournament in the city of Orlando in USA in the month of June. Additionally we have very active parent football teams at TES and I would encourage any parents who would like to be interested in playing for these teams and build friendship and contacts to contact their representative member of the Consejo de Padres who can help organise your involvement in these teams. We also held a weekend alumni football tournament held at TES which culminated in December of last year and had participation from many alumni who have attended TES over the years. There was a very high level of quality in this tournament and most of all it was thoroughly enjoyed by all and really helped us build a sense of community and belonging at the school. This alumni project is something we are continuing to promote and develop and please stay tuned for future updates about how our community, both past and present, can get involved. We are working to continue developing and improving our sports teams with the aim of increasing participation for all ranges of abilities and all ages and promoting excellence for our schools so the sports teams can flourish at TES with honour and pride. This will allow students to flourish, grow in confidence and enjoy all the psychological and physical benefits that sports participation can bring. If you have any questions or would like to know more information about sports in TES, please contact our Head of Sports, Thomas Tavar, and he'll be happy to let you know how you can become involved and participate. Many thanks for your attention. Please continue to take care, stay safe, follow all the biosecurity protocols for COVID-19, and I look forward to seeing you all next time for the March edition of Rexit's blog. See you soon.